Okay, 33, I'm going to look at it, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to borrow a sine from that sine 5, and you're going to get sine of x, and then you're going to get sine to the fourth power of x times cosine squared x. All right, what I'm going to do now is, I don't know, let's just try something, sine x, I'm going to write this thing as sine squared. That whole thing squared times cosine. Let's keep rewriting it. Sine x. And the sine squared is actually 1 minus cosine squared. Squared. And that's going to be cosine squared x. I'm going to make a u substitution now, and the u substitution I'm going to make, I'm going to make u equals uh, the cosine. That means du is going to be minus sine x dx. And when we pop that in, put a little star over here. I'm looking at this, and that's going to be minus du now. So I'm going to put the minus sign on the outside, and I'll put the du over here. Then what do I get? <coughs> I get 1 minus u squared. Squared. I just took care of this. What else do I see? I see u squared. Let's figure it out. And let's write this down carefully. That's going to be, let's see, 1 minus 2 u squared plus u4 times u squared du. All right, I'm going to multiply it out now. That's going to be, let's see, u squared minus 2u cubed. I'm sorry, 4. Sorry about that. Plus u6 du. I think I'm ready to integrate it. And what are you going to get there? Minus u cubed over 3. Let's see, plus 2u5 over 5 minus u7 over 7 plus some constant of integration. All right, now i got to go back to the u, and the u is cosine. So what are you going to get over here? You're going to get minus cosine cubed of x over 3 plus 2 cosine to the fifth power of x over 5, kind of running out of room, minus cosine to the 7th power of x over 7 plus some constant of integration. All right, let's look at the k, and uh, I want to see if I got the correct answer. I'm not looking at the work, by the way. Whoops, sorry about that. I want to see if I got this term, and I do see it's right over here. So minus cosine cubed x over 3. And did I get this one? which is 2 cosine to the fifth power. Yep, you got this one. Did I get this one over here? I did. All right, I got that one, and I got the constant integration. I do notice there's an error in my key, at least for consistency. I need to change this to C. We'll do that. Is this a multiple choice exam? I don't know. Let's take a look. No, it's not. They just want me to do it. We did it. We got the same answer they got. Thank you.